What is going on everyone? Welcome to the video. So before we get into what the video is really going to be about, just wanted to let you guys know of a cool announcement. If you guys already follow me on Instagram, you already know this, but if you don't follow me on Instagram, go do that. But I'll let you guys know what it is. So based on the shirt, I have signed with Universal and I am now proud to say that I am sponsored by Universal. And I've been a fan of this company for a very long time. I'm very happy to be with them. So what we have below here is a box of supplements that they sent me and I am going to open it and show you guys what's in here. So I know I don't really like when people do this on YouTube, opening boxes, but I'm doing it anyway. And some of you might be thinking, oh great, now he's going to be trying to sell us on Universal Supplements. That's not the case. Unlike most supplement companies that give you the like, like discount code, so I pitch like a discount code where you can save 10% and I get commission. There's no discount code. There's no commission. I don't act, I'm not going to be pushing supplements on you guys. I'll simply be using the supplements that I personally use anyway. And if I think something will be beneficial to you guys, I will recommend it. I'm not going to be sending you any kind of link for it. I'm not going to be giving you a code because like I said, I don't get commission from it. I simply chose to work with Universal because I believe in their stuff. I believe in what they stand for. And that's why I am with them. So I won't be doing what other people do, pushing supplements down your face. I will be using stuff. And as I use stuff, if I like it, I will let you guys know. So here is my first month supplements and what I chose to get. So I'm a big fan of whey protein. So what we got here is whey protein, chocolate, ice cream flavor. I wanted to try all the flavors. So we also got cookies and cream. This is casein protein, chocolate milkshake. More protein, double chocolate chip. And then I also like amino, oh I'm sorry, this is for Paula actually, the red velvet protein, just so she could try red velvet. And then what we got is Animal Pack, a multivitamin. Animal PM, this is like a sleeping formula, kind of like ZMA, but with a few extra ingredients. And then we got a bunch of amino acids in different flavors. So we got three of those. And last but not least, we got a brownie mix to try some brownies. And we got some protein bars that I will try. So. I don't want to bore you any further, but as you can see, nothing I got here is anything crazy. It's protein, it's protein bars, it's amino acids, it's all stuff that I use already. So I will try all this stuff out. The stuff that I recommend, I will recommend. And like I said, there is no discount code because I don't make commission. So just wanted to give you that, guys that announcement. You're going to be seeing me wearing a lot of universal stuff in videos. Uh, that's it for this for right now. Um, the rest of the video. I'm going to take you guys through a deadlift workout, but before we get to the deadlift workout, I'm going to show you me eating a little bit of Halo Pop for a minute. So that's the rest of the video. Like I said, I'm very excited to work with Universal. I've been a fan of them for a very long time, been a fan of Evans and the Pony for a long time, so it's cool to be working with the same company. That's enough of that. Let's get to the rest of the video. So looks like today we will go with some birthday cake halo top and we got some 16 handles cheesecake bites to put it with. Ta-da! So we got the birthday cake halo top, the cheesecake bites from 16 handles, Paula got the froyo and you always got to get the spoon to top it all off. So as you saw from the freezer, I still have like 15 pints of this stuff, so I'm not complaining, but still have a lot to go through. Uh, we went to Blaze Pizza for dinner. We did not film it because I forgot the camera, but we're going to eat this now, and we will see you at the gym. What's going on, everyone? Welcome to the workout. So here is my latest deadlift workout. It is the threes week. No, I'm sorry. It is the 531 week on 531, so I have to work up to an AMRAP set of 1 plus, and this week was 465 pounds. Um, ever since I got back from vacation, everything's felt a little bit heavy, um, so I still feel like I'm recovering from that. 
Uh, if you see my shoes, people always ask me about the shoes that I wear, and you might notice that they're a slightly different color in this video because I got the new Anis. They used to be the green ones. These are the blue ones. Um, if anyone wants these shoes, I highly recommend them for deadlifting. As you can see, I've worn them in every single deadlift video ever. They're very flat. They're very lightweight, better than Converse. Uh, if you use the code AFAO, I'll put the code in my in the description, and you want to purchase a pair, that will give you a discount. So the code is AFAO. They're pretty stylish and great for deadlifting. So what I actually wanted to go over during this workout, I made a post on Instagram the other day. I got a lot of questions from other people, so I thought I would elaborate a little bit here. And that's pretty much the, uh, the difference between a bro split and an upper lower split. I, I made a comment, or the whole post is about how I made faster progress on an upper lower split uh, rather than a bro split. So basically, if you don't know, a bro split is what like a lot of bodybuilders did back in the day, they still do. It's where you dedicate one workout per week to each body part. So you have a leg day, you have an arm day, a shoulder day. Basically, you go to the gym five days a week and every day you're working a different body part. Um, an upper lower split is more of what I do, where you break everything up into an upper body workout, lower body workout, and you do that twice per week. Um, you could do more than four workouts. You could break your upper body further than that, where you do um, three upper body workouts per week and two lower bodies. But essentially, it's you're hitting everything more than once per week, and rather than focus each workout on one body part, you're focusing on upper body and lower body. And the post is about how I find that to be more effective, especially for natural lifters. So. Like I said, I do not believe in body part splits. I do actually think they're kind of more fun, but I think that the higher frequency is necessary if you want to make faster progress. So when you're only hitting a body part once per week, that's only one opportunity, I guess you could say, for your muscle to recover and to grow. So if you hit, let's say, chest on Monday, your chest might be fully recovered by Wednesday, Thursday at the latest, and now you're going Friday, Saturday, Sunday, not hitting your chest. So your chest has these three days where basically it's nothing's happening. It could be stimulated again so you can continue growing, but instead you're waiting till the next week to hit it again, and you're essentially losing the opportunity for your chest to grow a second time during the week. And that's not, that's not just for chest, that's for every body part. I'm just using that as an example. So when you uh, look at that over the course of a year, if you're basically getting 50% of the potential activation of a muscle each week, over the course of a year, that adds up to a lot. And if you had just done everything more often, you probably would get better results. So I personally think that the upper lower split is far superior. As a natural, you don't need to do crazy volume each workout. A lot of people try to do like 20 sets for legs. You don't really need to do 20 sets. You could do you might you could do 20 sets throughout the week, but by breaking it up into separate workouts, you'll get better results. And that's my personal opinion. That's what I've noticed. And anyone that works with me, I'll never have anyone do a body part split. Although I do admit body part splits can be more fun. Um, I do not think they are the most effective to make progress. So anyway, the workout footage is coming to an end. Um, if you guys have any questions, feel free to leave it in the comments below. Again, if you want the Ani shoes, use the code AFAL for a discount. I will put the link and the code in the description box below. If you guys want to check out Universal Supplements, like I said in the beginning, no discount code or anything, but I highly recommend them. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit the thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And I will see you guys in the next video.